Yeah, there's only a few days left of spring cleanup in the, the one town that I go to, but I figured I could get what I can. It's been pretty picked through, but I got some stuff. I got a half a bucket of copper wire here. There's a, it's almost like 250 or 300 foot extension cord. So I'll take it. And here's a neat box for the kitchen. I'm not sure what it's for, but I think it's for recipes maybe, or it's just really weird the way it opens it. Never seen nothing quite like that before. Got another creeper on the curb. They seem to sell really good at a garage sales, so I keep picking them up. Some random junk here. <laughs> Only got one trampoline spring today. The other day I got probably 200 of them. Just some more junk. This hedge trimmer works. It's a Murray. Kind of neat. It's got a taped up handle, but I think that's just like the safety for the, I don't know. It works though. Some more scrap. Got some brass here. A little candlestick. Got a little rusty sleigh bell, I guess. Some brass. There's a ceramic bird in here. I haven't taken a look at it yet. It's kind of, oh, Japan, I guess. Kathy, I don't know. Some more brass. Got a whisk, tin snips. The sun decides to come out now, that's nice. Got a heat gun, that was in the box. It, the box was all wet, it had rained last night, but I'm sure it still works. Got an air compressor, I'm not sure if that works yet, I haven't checked out yet. Got a miter saw, it's missing the bolt and the nut to put the blade on, but other than that, I think it probably works. It's just a cheap one, but if it doesn't work, that's a really heavy aluminum base on there. Some um, Highline pole climbing things, I think. I'm not sure. I think that's what it's for. More car part shock strut thing. A couple of rakes, shovels, and I got a pole saw. It's broken, but I got a couple of extension cords here too. Here. These I'm not gonna scrap I'm just gonna scrap that. It's that's that one's only two wire, but this is three wire, so I'll keep these. But I guess I'll oh yeah I also got a Ford Super Duty grill. It's a it's got a date code thing on the back here. Oh nine. I don't think there's anything broken on it so I might try to sell it or I don't know quite what I want to do with that yet. Maybe hanging on the wall? I don't know. Alright guys, till next time.